Hello. I'm Popular Woodworking Magazine Senior Editor Chuck Fender, and I'm here today to talk to you about a woodworking epidemic that is sweeping the nation. It's called idle shopolitis. Here at Popular Woodworking Magazine, we've done extensive research into idle shopolitis, and we've discovered the cause. And now that we've discovered that cause, we've developed and implemented a treatment. But there's still so much more we can all do to help stamp out this dreadful affliction. Each year across North America, workshops sit idle. Table saws, hand planes, carving chisels gather dust unused. Finish hardens in the can and workbench tops go unflattened. It's a tragedy, I know. We know from our extensive research that idle shopolitis occurs because many woodworkers just lack proper education. With just the smallest bit of encouragement and instruction, workshops can be filled with the sounds of plane shavings being made and projects nearing completion. Now that you're aware of idle shopolitis and its cause, I'd like to talk to you about the cure woodworking in America. If you've never been to a WIA before, now's your chance to sign up and attend and help us stamp out idle shopolitis. If you're, a, if you're a woodworker, the spouse of a woodworker, or the significant other, or just a friend of a woodworker that you know has idle shopolitis, head on over to woodworkinginamerica.com and do your part today. I'm going to be doing my part at Woodworking in America by teaching three classes along with all of the other instructors to help stamp out idle shopolitis. My first class is going to help woodworkers move from square to round in turning for furniture makers, legs turned, slender, and round. I'm going to be covering a little bit of the history of the turned leg in furniture and give you some tips and tricks on how to turn them and add them to your pieces of furniture. I'll also be teaching frame and panel case construction. We're going to cover the joinery on how to, how to put a frame and panel together properly. We're going to cover a little bit of the history of frame and panel uh, construction in case work throughout history. And I'm going to show you a couple of ways to treat the molded edge on the inside of the frame. Lastly, I'll be teaching a class on period proper details. So, if you're out there trying to make a reproduction and idle shopolitis has overtaken you because you just don't know whether you should use a sliding dovetail, a full blind dovetail, or some other period method of construction, this is the class for you. It will help start you on the path to rehabilitation from idle shopolitis. Now it's time for you to do your part to help stamp out idle shopolitis head over to woodworkinginamerica.com and register today. Your participation is really gonna help us beat this horrible affliction because, as you know, a workshop is a terrible thing to waste.